So my name is David Asloff, and uh, I would love it if, if you uh, could explain Docker. I mean, what is a Docker? Okay, I'm going to try my best to explain this. A Docker container is a lightweight, standalone, comfortable package of software that can run on application code, runtime, system tools, libraries, and settings. That's a Docker. <laughs> off, off. Hey, yo, check this out. This is Flavor Flav in the building for devs. Hey, yo, check one, two. I got a nice prize shout-out coming to you guys, you know what I'm saying, from Tristan Polak. You know what I'm saying, who's a developer. And would love to explain what Kubernetes is, you know what I'm saying? What is Kubernetes? Well, the answer is a Kubernetes cluster is a set of node machines for running containerized applications. If you're running Kubernetes, you're running a cluster. Now, yo, check this out. Whatever that means, you know what I'm saying? Yo, that's coming from my man, Kristen Pollock. You know what I'm saying? Yo, Tristan. Hey, yo, thank you for booking your boy Flavor Flavor to do this shout out. You know what I'm saying? Because this is one of the craziest shout outs that I've ever done. You know what I mean? But I hope I nailed it and I hope I brought it home, B. You know what I'm saying? Word up, G. On a strength. Hey, yo, devs, this is for you, G, by my man Tristan Pollock and your boy Flavor Flav. You all know what time it is in the building, baby. Hey, all you cool cats and kittens who are devs. It's Carol Baskin from Big Cat Rescue, and goodness knows I love technology, and I especially love AWS. Tristan reached out to me and said that he's a developer and wanted me to explain AWS, and I only know it from a small uh, part of what I use it for, but what I use it for is so important to Big Cat Rescue. That's where we store so many videos and photos and things that just can't be replaced because I know AWS is secure and that it's in the cloud. I can reach it from anywhere. And it's just been, it's been such a godsend to me. And there's other things that we use it for too. Like we have the Alexis app and I use it for that. And so there's just so many things that I still haven't even learned how to do with AWS, but it is, it's just this comprehensive, cloud platform and it offers hundreds of services. When I look at that page and there's just list after list after list of things that most of them, I don't even know what they're talking about because they're talking in dev talk, which you guys would know all about. But um, fortunately, unfortunately, I, I don't know how to use even a small fraction of it. If I did, imagine how powerful I could be. Oh my goodness. I really love that these services these services are from um, data centers that are strategically placed globally. So you have that redundancy that is so, so crucial. And in all the years that I've been using it, I've not once, not once had any kind of a problem. So I love AWS and I think you could just call it like the king of serverless. Stay cool, cats.